With echoes of eco less than a week away, here are all my predictions on what's coming in this update. As we all know, on Wednesday the 17th of April, the second ever Echoes of Eco will begin. But what will come in this update? Firstly, Amber Island's seasonal skin will return along with all of the Amber Island vessels, so you better be saving those relics. Secondly we will get four brand new Echoes of Eco themed decorations and costumes that will only be able to be purchased during Echoes of Eco. Finally, we will get the all new Epic Vivine, which will be able to be bought or bred on Amber Island, Sugarbush Island and Seasonal Shanty. As for what the Epic Vivine could look like, it will have the critters from other islands. I believe these will be the Earth, Haven and one of the Magical Island's critters, as well as Vivine itself having a new look. I think the Epic Vivine will tie into cherry blossom trees and exotic flowers as it is the spring season and that's when trees and flowers start to bloom. It's that time where Mulch makes another appearance in one of my videos, but you know what they say, third time's the charm. However this time I think one of two Wublins could be getting a rare, those being Mulch and Pixelata. Now I have my reasonings for why both of these could be the next rare Wublin to be added to the game. Mulch could be getting a rare as, like I've stated in my previous videos, it could have overgrowth and plants growing on it, therefore tying into Echoes of Eco. However Pixelotl could be getting a rare as April's core seasonal event is Extravaganza, which is the water seasonal event, and which Wublin resembles the water element the most, Pixelotl. No not that, Mimic. In the recent quick questions video the official MSM YouTube account posted, there is something interesting to note at the end of the video. Here's the clip. Final question asks, what if Mimic has been in the modern monster world this whole time and they've just been mimicking another monster? Huh. I've actually never, never thought of that as a possibility. Huh. Now this is, as I said here, definitely a teaser to Mimic being added to the main game. But the question still stands, how and when will Mimic be added? I have mentioned this in a video before, but there are some things I would like to add to it. As I stated in the video, I believe that Mimic will be added to Fire Oasis but also Gold Island as it is a natural monster. However, I am starting to believe it will be added to all of the natural islands instead of Fire Oasis, since it is the natural Quinn. But, because Mimic may have been disguising itself as a different monster, this brings us to more evidence that Mimic may come to Fire Oasis. As seen in the Feast Ember 2019 trailer, we can hear Gobbly Gord mimicking the other monsters. Now what other island is Gobbly Gord on? Fire Oasis. So I believe there are two possible outcomes for Mimic in the main game, the Natural Islands, or Fire Oasis. But I think the release of Mimic in the main game will most likely be during Perplex Floor. And don't think I forgot about Ethereal Workshop. If you want to see my Ethereal Workshop Wave 4 prediction click on the video on screen now and subscribe.